Hi all folks, today we're going to take our Atrix 4G and enable it so we can use the the web top without uh, having a laptop dock or a USB dock because it's kind of expensive. Anyway, there's a hack online. Anyway, download the file. I give you uh, Atrix 4G dash dock zip. This has all the files you need. So unzip it using your favorite unzipper program and uh, move this whole folder the whole folder into the root directory of your C drive or whatever you're using so now under C drive I have that and we're going to go to start and type cmd open up a command prompt and uh, let me zoom in so you can see better and we're going to go cd slash atrix 4g dash doc alright and here we're gonna type all this stuff I'll have it but you can just copy and paste it and paste right do that oh and also I forgot to tell you make sure your your phone is in uh, USB debugging mode what you gotta do is go to there and uh, applications uh, development. Make sure USB debugging is checked on and also make sure your USB connection is set to none. Oh, there you go. Like that. And then and then you'll do that. ADB push doc. Uh, let me adjust my monitor. can't even see it that well. There we go. Like that. Hit enter. So if you get some, some kind of something like that you're fine. And then also paste this adb push portal app dot apk uh, slash mnt sd card like that, and then type adb shell. It's gonna give you into the shell of your uh, your atrix, and do su, and go to your phone and make sure it allow. If this is the first time you're using your super user rooted. And you need a rooted Atrix 4G, I forgot to tell you, sorry. And then type all this. I just copy and paste it. Um, and then and then paste this. Alright. I'll have this you can just copy and paste it. Like this. And then paste the next one. And then the next one. Uh oh. Get... Oh, you know what? Did I forget to? Huh? Okay, I'm not sure what happened. Let's just skip that one. And that, and then, hopefully, and then reboot. So my phone's gonna reboot. I'll be back when it reboots and hopefully we'll have webtop running on off HDMI. Hi all folks, so I've got it restarted. Just connect your HDMI cable. Sorry, it's kind of dark here. The HDMI cable to your TV or monitor and hook it in. And now you'll get you'll get a, a option to use the webtop instead of just the entertainment center. So I'm gonna go into the web top and let's see if it actually worked. Let me uh, show you. And let me change my screen. The input, oops. There we go. Yeah, look at that. So I've got it. I've got the web top working now uh, without the dock. Now the next step, I'm going to hook up my Bluetooth keyboard and my Bluetooth mouse and show you that it's actually working. Because right now it's nothing's hooked up. So, oh, you know what? You can actually use your uh, <laughs> you can actually use your uh, touch screen as mouse. How cool is that, right? Actually, let me just show you how cool this is. So. Oh, but I can't type. That's the only thing. 
Oh, there is a typing. Yeah, never mind. It has a keyboard and a mouse. It has a keyboard, so I can use the keyboard, or I can go, uh, oop, use the mouse too. So let's go, go do something fun. Now I don't. I, I, I thought I couldn't use this, so I'm gonna go have some fun right now. Um, this is actually hella cool. So I'm gonna go go here and go check out my site. Actually, it's not doing too bad. It's pretty fast. Um, and uh, you've got your thing there. This is pretty cool. Let me go, f Let me go make it full. I forgot what the resolution is on this. Oh yeah, it's. I think it's 1280 by... What number is it? Oh, there goes my pop-up. Please hit the like button. Um, okay. I don't like this. Uh, oops. Anyway, uh, go have fun with it. This is gonna be a lot of fun. I'm gonna go install Ubuntu now, and then uh, just go have fun. And then, you know, this is kind of fun. So, <laughs> see y'all later. Subscribe. Actually, let me give you uh, something cool. I guess it does flash pretty cool. I mean, I tried out the laptop laptop dock at the, at the uh, store, but it works. Let me see if they can do 1080p resolution. It's running faster than the one I tried at AT&T for some reason. So I've got using 1080p running off my my uh, my phone here. Um, will do 1080p. It's kind of slow. Okay. With a LED battery, oh yeah. It also had Look at that! It's working! Pretty good, actually. It's kind of laggy. It's a front-facing camera. Okay, it's very laggy. I'm gonna get out. Um, but... Uh, will you shut up? <laughs> uh, but my Facebook button works, too. Oops. Where'd I go? Ah, uh, you know what? Anyway, that was the review of it. Kind of failed there, but... Um, I don't know what happens. Oh, it's just really slow. Anyway, that was the, how you uh, put um, the web top without having a laptop top. See you later. So here's good news. I've, I've got my uh, mouse connected, so I can go a little bit faster. Uh, everything works. My mouse works fine. Don't get jealous. Get an Atrix 4G. <laughs> Um, okay, this is my phone. Uh, I'm gonna get out. Go play with it. Um, so, let's go check out some sites and gadgets. Oh, you know what? Uh, let me hook up my Bluetooth real quick. I forgot, key I don't have a keyboard here.